Hi, it's Barbara and welcome back to Wiki Design. In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to add a service fee to your WooCommerce shop. A service fee is essentially a tax that you add on top of your total. And it's actually pretty easy to do, but the settings are a little bit hidden. So I'm going to teach you where to go to add that fee. So this is the site that I'm currently working on. It's just a demo site and I have my shop set up right here. So these are my two products and I'm going to add a service fee to those products at checkout. So in order to do that, I'm going to go into my WooCommerce settings. The first thing that you'll want to make sure you have ticked on is under general, and that is to enable taxes. So if you click that on and then go down to the bottom and hit save changes, you get a couple more options for tax. So there are all different types of taxes that you can add. It might be your state sales tax, or it could be something like a service fee, depending on your business. So you'll go click on the tax tab next, and you can see here that there are some different options for entering tax. So you can set those up however is appropriate for your store. You can see all the different options here. Next, you'll want to click on standard rates. And in here, this is where you will put in your tax. So you'll hit insert row, and that's going to give you these different options in this table. So you can put in your country code, your state code, zip codes for the tax, a city, rate, the tax name, priority, compound, and shipping. For a service fee, you don't have to change any of this. You can keep all of this the same because it will just add it on top. So really the only thing that you have to worry about is the percentage. So whatever percentage service fee you want to add, you would put that in here. So let's say it's a 3% service fee. So you just put in three here. And then under tax name, you can name this whatever you want. So I'm just going to name this service fee but maybe you can do shipping and handling or some other name. And then you'll hit save changes and that's going to add a 3% tax to the order. So let's go to our store again and I'm just going to add a product to my cart. I'm still working on this, so stay tuned for additional videos on how to create product pages and customize checkout pages in Elementor, make sure you're subscribed for that. But you can see here under the cart page, we have our subtotal and then we have this line for service fee. So it's adding a 3% tax to the $15 total. If we go to our checkout page, you should see it down here as well. So you can see here, we have our service fee at the bottom. So that's a quick video on how to add a service fee. In certain instances, I know that businesses have to do this. So in WooCommerce, they kind of hide it, but it's actually pretty easy to do once you know where to go. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and give this video a like. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.